Please stand for the pledge. Put your right hand over your heart. Ready, begin. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. You may be seated. Good morning! Ha! Huh, we're getting close to something. I wonder what it is. Thanksgiving, of course! So welcome to your last week of school before your Thanksgiving break. As mentioned before, things are about to really start moving quickly for you and you have a, a couple of important things to do before our Thanksgiving break. So just to remind everyone, you do not come to school next week for the entire week. That's right, the 25th until the 29th is your Thanksgiving break. Not a day before and not a day after. That does not count as an excused absence. Make sure you let your parents know if you're going to go out of town or if you're going to do any vacationing that you do it during those five, six, seven, eight, nine days. You have nine days off next week, counting Saturday and Sunday. So middle of the year assessments are here. What does that mean? It means you're going to take the star test in math and in reading one more time. What are we expecting? We're expecting for whatever you scored in the beginning of the school year for your grade to be higher than it was in the beginning of the school year. Why does that matter? Because then that lets us know if your classes need to remain the same or if they need to change for second semester. When is second semester? After winter break. So middle of the year assessment is your time to let us know how is your brain doing? Are you getting smarter or are you just getting older? Make sure that you do your best and let us know your story. If you're only guessing and you are in a class that you're not supposed to be, that's no one's fault but your own. Do your best. It tells you the story. It tells us your story. Middle of the year assessments coming soon. VIP bracelets. Want to let everyone know that our VIP bracelets are uh, coming very soon. So if you have three of the bracelets that we are handing out during student of the month, you come to the office, turn in those three bracelets, and in return, you get a thicker bracelet that says VIP. All VIP students will be uh, have events free of charge. All dances, all events will cost you zero dollars. You also will have a bonus PBIS points. You will also be in front of the line during snack and lunch for the entire school year. So congratulations to those of you who already have two bracelets. Many of you are very, very close to being our VIPs this year. Want to thank everyone for your maturity and representing SMA during the Vital Link uh, presentation two days ago. We had nothing but positive feedback from the people who brought you this program so that you can explore and be thinking about different careers in your life. The number one difference between someone who has a career and someone who doesn't is a plan. A plan are goals and dreams with deadlines. Okay, you can have a dream, but if you don't have a goal, it's never going to come true. So we're hoping that Vitalink gives you some opportunity to think about what do I want to do for the rest of my life once middle school is over? Because you're not going to be here forever. One day you'll be old like me. And you have to think about what is your purpose and your job in life. So thank you so much for being engaged and being respectful. We got lots of great feedback about you and how you were behaving during that presentation. I really appreciate it. We don't have any new wins so far. We still only have two people in our SMA wins. The jar is not quite filled yet. So remember that when this jar is filled, we pause and celebrate the wins. Keep those wins coming in. Don't forget to attach your proof and we will be calling a winner at the end of December because November is such a short month. 
by the way, to end, our winter raffle is coming up. So for those of you who are thinking about your PBIS points and you're saving them or you want to buy something big, I just want to let you know so that you're not disappointed. Every year we have a winter raffle. You will get to choose where you want to put your raffle tickets. There will be prizes that are worth 100 PBIS points, 50 PBIS points, 20 PBIS points, 5 PBIS points, and we have the raffle the last day of win before winter break. If you're not here, you don't win. Winner must be present at the winter raffle, but I just want to let you know for those of you who might be saving up the winter raffle, we're going to have lots of prizes. We spend over $500 in prizes during our winter raffle event. That's it. Have a wonderful last week of learning. And I just want to let you know that I'm very thankful and appreciative of the opportunity to be your principal. It is absolutely an honor, even though it's very hard work sometimes. I'm so grateful for each and every one of you. Have a good week.